Hello everyone, Aspirin here, coming on a one gonna do a part, well, not really a part two, really. Um, this toy I'm about to show you is actually the 2007 version, and it came with the Raphael. It's a bonus pack, but the only difference is, is my Raphael is not here, but I got an idea. Uh, they're re-releasing the new Turtle Toys. That's, that is actually 1988 toys. And they uh, brought back the 2007 action figures with it. So the machines that they actually ride around in, yeah, they brought it back. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about, but I'll show you right here. But this, this one is actually just Raphael ones. No one else's. And uh, they add on more weapons to it, but I will show you what I'm talking about. But first, if you want to shop somewhere easy, somewhere where it's cheap, and somewhere it's fair and nice people, Fire Corners, feel free to afford us if you already know the one is my heart. And pause it if you already know, if you need to, I'll write it down. First store is on top, second store is on the bottom, just so I want to swap me. Good stuff, believe me. Facebook, and our phone number. Alright, so it's like I said, I don't have a Raphael with me. This is the machine that comes with the 2007. Actually, let's see. Do do do. do. Touch it up. Let's see. Let's attach it to this. Guess the bolt, the back part. Turns on. I think they still have batteries in this thing. 19, oh, 2008. Works with a plane with Soyuz made in China. And uh, like I said, Raphael goes right in the middle. Here are the missiles, as you can see on top. The sidearms. These things are really cool. They actually made one for the two, 2004 version as well. These things are really popular, so they're bringing it back. Of course, this piece is rubber right here. Actually. And the joints and everything. So this is what they had the idea for. They're like, okay, well, how about we lift this up, and we'll get we don't, well, since I don't know where Raphael's are at, we'll put Leonardo in there. Let's see. They did this. They put Leonardo right in the middle, and then they closed it. And that's what it looks like for the new Turtle Toys that just coming out. And people are saying it's like twenty dollars. Some people are saying it's fifty bucks just to do this. I don't know what's going on with the new Turtle Toys. Like, the new Party Wagon is coming out, and um, they're asking for like 40 or 50 bucks for it. So, Playmates, if you're watching and if you know anyone who works at Playmates, listen up. I know you listen to your fans. Lower down the price if you really want people to actually support you guys. Seriously, don't try to overprice it because, or fans, because believe me, it will be worth it to buy it for something that's cheap, like the old days. But anyways, they claim they listen to us, but they don't sometimes. But yeah, this is what it's gonna look like, people. This is all what it's gonna look like, exactly like this. So let's take them out. And I can see. I don't know. I've never done this. Actually, try this way. Oh, but hang on. So you lift. Okay, you flip the lid open, and you flip the switch. Actually, there it goes. So that's what it looks like. Put it in. Voila. Close it up. Does the same thing over here. And of course, over here is the same thing as well. However, I don't know how I could do this, but I'm going to try my best. Uh, it's supposed to fold back like this. So right like this. Or something along with that because it has a wheel right here. Move this all the way. I really don't understand how it's supposed to work, but supposedly the turtle's supposed to ride like this or something like that. And it pulls a roll. Let's see. There we go. There's a roll like this. And I'm going to 
part puzzle come up here. Oh, by the way, I forgot to show you this. Piece of puzzle open up like that. It's plastic, so don't worry about it. And that's where they put the legs in. Where did this come from? And why aren't you going back in? Doop doop doop. <laughs> hey, we'll go back in. Oh wait. No. Hey. Eh? What? What? Okay. So I don't think that's it. I don't know why this thing came off. Ah, we'll figure, we'll figure it out later. <laughs> okay, so it like this. He's supposed to roll, yada yada yada. There's handlebars right here. <laughs> and there are handlebars right there to hold on to. I'm gonna lift this back up. Hang on. Having difficulties with toys. Alright, so it was like that. However, you put the batteries in the back. This might be really loud, and I hope I don't wake no one up. Okay, here's a switch. I don't want to do it from here. There you go. So. Actually, maybe it wasn't too loud. That's backwards. This is forward. And it takes on the first order. Just like that. Alright, so we got that out of the way. <sighs> Alright people, believe it or not, I actually got this for like $20, seriously. And now to play my new ones that's coming out with the original Turtle Toys of 88. I don't know, um, if anybody's watching and you have those new um, 30th anniversary or whatever they're supposed to be, and you open them up, check the back of the shell. Tell me what year does it say, does it actually say 88, or does it say 2013, or 2014, I mean, what does it say in the back? But, uh, with this one right here, I mean, I love this machine, I really do. But, it seems like they're asking way too much for it. I mean, 50 bucks for 20, instead of $20. I don't know, I mean, call me crazy, but I wouldn't pay that much for this. If I'm going to buy, buy something for, that's something that actually costs, like, 50 bucks. I can't even remember what it was. But, for $30, I, the Titan Drill was actually $30 when I saw it. And they wanted 50 bucks for something like this. Seriously, I don't know what's going on. I don't know if it's true or not, but I had to see it with my own eyes, and I will record it if I have to, or take a picture of it. But um, but for this, get online, see if you can find it for cheap. I'll put the title of it above, and then um, and I hope all of you actually get it. I only got one out of a whole collection. I never got to the 2K5 or to the four ones. I was too late for that. But I did save enough money, and I got the money, got me the Raphael one, which I'm really happy about. So, my opinion is this toy is a lot of fun, like really cool. You can run over anything you want with it. It's just for a controller, you have to you know make a reverse and everything else. But um, besides that, this toy is really cool. So, add us to your collection, people. Seriously, add us to your collection. Uh, take care of yourself, and happy hunting, everybody. See you later.